Hey, what's up everybody? This is Chicken Possible with Rewards Hunter, back with another Xbox Game Pass quest guide. Well, I take that back. This is actually a brand new series that I'm calling Fictional Game Pass Quests. Some of you may remember that prior to January of this year, we regularly had Game Pass quests that were released for specific games that were available on Game Pass, and they would kind of encourage you to take a look at certain games, get used to them, experience them, try them out, and then you would earn some rewards points for doing that. But then in January of this year, those quests were removed, so we no longer, unfortunately, are encouraged to play specific games in Game Pass. The quests are more general, and you can kind of do whatever you want to do at this point. But I did always enjoy the game-specific Game Pass quests, and I know a lot of other people did too. So I'm going to try out this new series. Let me know what you all think in the comments, whether you all like this or not. But we're going to do a fictional Game Pass quest today. Don't look for this anywhere on your Xbox or in the Xbox app or anything. This is fictional, it's made up by me, and you won't be able to find it there. But I did go ahead and make up this little graphic to kind of illustrate what I'm looking for here. So this looks official, but just keep in mind this is made just by me. So the quest that we're going to do today is for the game Hell Let Loose, which was recently added to Game Pass. And what we're going to do is work on dropping three ammo boxes within the game. This needs to be completed by March 31st. Unfortunately, you're not going to get any rewards points for doing this, so I've specifically put zero rewards points on this graphic. But I am going to be doing a giveaway at the end of the month for all of the people that complete the quest. You'll have the opportunity to enter into into the giveaway. I've got four codes to give out for a new Ubisoft game called Skull and Bones, and this is going to be the premium edition of the game. So if you do complete this quest, and I'm able to tell that you did complete it, then I will add you into the giveaway, and four people are going to win codes for that game. And I'll talk a little bit more about that at the end of this video, so stay tuned to the end to get some more details on the giveaway and get entered into that. But for now, let's go ahead and get started on the quest, and we're going to get started in the game which is called Hell Let Loose. It's available on Game Pass, of course, and this one is available on the cloud, so if you want to play it through the cloud, you'll be able to do that as well. So this is a multiplayer game. It is in World War II, and I would say it's fairly difficult to survive in this, but the quest itself is going to be relatively easy, so this will just kind of get you exposed to the game just a little bit. So a couple of different modes you could work on in this. You could play in the Warfare and Offensive default mode. There's also Skirmish that's available. You could play in that if you'd like to. Or if you want to go through some of the basic training first, then that is available here on the main menu as well. But I'm just going to go ahead and jump into the Warfare and Offensive category, and we'll get started in a multiplayer match there. So it'll take just a minute to search for a match for us. You'll see it searching at kind of the bottom right section there and it'll load us into a match with some other players. So we're going to be in Caritan in France. And then if we look on the left side of the screen, there are all these different units that are over there. So you could create your own infantry unit, or you could join into an existing one. So I'm just going to join into an existing one that has a few people in it here. So I'm going to join into this George unit. So you can see I've got the little arrow highlighted there in yellow on the left side of the screen. I'm going to start out as a rifleman because the rifleman has easy access to the ammo box. So I'm just going to select rifleman here and press A to select that role. You can choose here on the map in the middle where you want to deploy at. So I'm just going to deploy at the default spawn here, number one, and then I'll press A to get started. So it'll take about 30 seconds or so to go ahead and deploy you into the match and get you started in combat. So I'll just skip ahead where you can see that the match is going ahead and starting up. So like I said, this is a multiplayer game, so you have a lot of other fellow soldiers that start out in the match with you, and you can feel free to follow along with them and get into the combat. The main thing that we're going to be doing for the quest is holding down the right bumper and then using the right stick to select the small ammunition box. So select that, and then basically you're just going to point at the ground at an empty space and then hold down the right trigger to drop the ammo box. 
Now you could just drop it anywhere, just right at the starting point if you wanted to, or you can you know, go to an area where you see some other soldiers that are working on shooting and fighting against the enemies, and then you can drop the ammo box you know, kind of close to them to where they could potentially use it a little bit more. Or you can use it yourself if you're taking some shots and using up a bunch of ammunition. But unfortunately, the ammo box only recharges after about three to five minutes. So if you try to use it again immediately, you'll find out that it's grayed out. So you will have to actually play the game or at least be in the game for a few minutes in order to drop the three ammo boxes that we're looking to drop. So you'll basically just want to, you know, hide or do some combat for a few minutes. And then you may actually die in the game. I died quite a few times during this playthrough. So if you do die, then just pick another spawn point, spawn back in, it'll take a few seconds to get you back into the game, and you'll be right back up and start it again. You will still need to wait the three to five minutes to actually get your next ammo box refilled. It just happens automatically, and after about that three to five minute period, then you'll be able to hit the right bumper and then select the ammunition box again and drop it somewhere on the ground. And like I said, I had quite a few deaths during this, so don't be worried if you have some deaths, you know, that doesn't matter. We don't need to stay alive for this. We're basically just trying to drop the ammo boxes. So I definitely got into some good combat here. I started fighting against some guys in a tank and took some shots. I don't think I ever actually defeated anybody in this, but I'm a fairly new player to this game. So, so I hope you have a good time with this one. Just make sure you drop all three of your ammo boxes. And after you've dropped your third one, then basically the quest will be complete for you. Since this is a fictional Game Pass quest, don't expect anything to pop up on screen, of course. But just know that after you've dropped your third ammo box, then you should be in good shape. So that is pretty much it for the Hell Let Loose quest. So just drop your three ammo boxes, make sure you get it done before March 31st, and you will be finished with this quest. So I mentioned that I would talk more about the giveaway at the end. So like I said, I'm gonna be giving away four codes to the Skull and Bones Premium Edition from Ubisoft. Thank you so much to Ubisoft for sharing these codes with the Rewards Hunter community. And basically what you need to do is you need to complete the quest and then you'll want to make sure that you fill out the form. I'm going to link to it here and in the description. So if you finish the quest, then just share your gamer tag with me on this Google form. And I'm not gonna be sharing those gamer tags with anybody. I'm basically just gonna use that to send the code to you if you do happen to win. So if you do finish the quest, just make sure that you fill out the Google form, let me know your gamer tag, and you will be entered into the giveaway. So again, just let me know what you think in the comments about this new series, about this fictional Game Pass Quest guide series, and whether you like it or not, whether you think I should do some more of these, I'm thinking about possibly doing around one per month or so, making this kind of a monthly quest thing that I do, and a monthly series. But let me know if you all like it. That will definitely help to influence whether I make more of these or not. So I hope everybody's having a great March, and I will look forward to seeing you all in the future guides. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you found that video helpful, please be sure to click the subscribe button here on YouTube and hit the bell for notifications. You can also find some helpful links in the description if you want to stay connected. Stay tuned for more Microsoft Rewards and Achievement Guides, and I'll see you in the next one.